Hey guys, in this video I will be showing you some screenshots from the from the trailer being shown right now and just talk a bit about resurrection and all the cool cool new features and I point out a good few things out of this trailer as well that you may have missed. So I'm just gonna wait for it to finish and then show you the screenshots. Okay, so for the screen first screenshot here I have one of the characters um going through this door that looks really cool, really spacey, and it's probably one of those doors that you have to uh, uh pay to open with your points and look it's basically looks really cool altogether. Okay, so in this screenshot here you, you can see one of the characters putting on a gas mask. This is from sorry, not a gas mask, one of the space spacesuit um masks. And this is from pers first person view and uh, he uh, maybe when you go down you might lose lose your space mask or um, the zombies might break it and you have to buy another one but or maybe you can just take it on and take it off whenever you please but he seems to be putting it on here so good to find out what that does okay so here's another really cool screenshot and it's one of the characters just floating through the air you, can, you see this in the video I showed just before and he, uh, the gravity is awesome I think because he's just floating through the air shooting the Olympia and looks really cool Okay, so here's another really important screenshot, and this is of one of the characters shooting a zombie, which is in a spacesuit, which is really weird. I'd say he, I'd say he's a boss. I'm just going to show you some effects of what happens. I'm going to load up the picture here now. Um, wh so once you kill the zombie, um, he explodes in this kind of light, and yeah, the character goes flying, and he might take out a few zombies around him as well, like the napalm from Shangri-La, so that's you just getting shot up into the air from um, from you killing the zombie and him exploding so that's really cool, I can't, I can't wait to take on those bosses as well and up next here is another screenshot of an, what I think is another boss, the phasing zombie okay so here is a picture of the zombie I think is the phasing zombie he seems really fast and I think j as, I heard, as you've heard that he goes invisible but and then visible again just before he attacks you, which I think he is right now visible just before he attacks you, and he seems to run really fast. He has that red mist behind him to maybe help you find where he is, <laughs> and um, he looks really cool, uh, fast as well. I'd say he could be a challenge to kill. He's probably strong as well, so I'm looking forward to to taking on him. Okay, so here is a really interesting screenshot, and it's of a zombie. We, he kind of jumped himself up into this. Uh, I, I don't even know how to describe this. Um, seems like maybe a warp. Maybe that's how you get outside the the building or so, or something. I don't have a clue. So I'd really like for you to um, send in your comments, tell me what you think that is, or if anyone knows what it is. Be really helpful, and I'll and I'll share your comments in one of my next videos because I'm really interested to see what you think this is because I have no idea whatsoever. Okay, so here in this screenshot, we have some more QED, and he's just um, ready to QED there, push it in, or whatever you have to do to prepare it just before you throw it. And the really cool thing here that I just noticed there in the background, if I can zoom in, I think that might be the new perk, the tree gun tequila. Picture's kind of blurry, but it, it looks like it looks to be like it. I'll just get it from here again. So that, that might be the location of the tree gun tequila, which would be cool to find out. And here I have one of the effects of the QED when it's thrown. That's just about to explode. Um, zombies, I'm not sure they're attracted to it, but they seem to be kind of running in towards it. So maybe they are. And then there's just kind of the after effect. It, it spreads out, kind of sweeping the whole area. Um, you may take damage if you get too close. And be interesting to find out about. Okay, so in this picture, uh, there's another picture to follow after this in a minute. You've seen this in the video as well. It's probably easier to recognize in the video, but these toxic crawlers, as they, this might be how they spawn in or something, but as they go through this type of type of dome, you could say, um, they get bigger. Um, must be something to do with this yellow yellow thing floating around. But I have a screenshot here of them just as they go through. They get so here's them. They just went through and they've clearly got bigger in size. I'll just switch back to the other one now, and yeah, they're clearly bigger. Um, so I'm not sure what's going on there, but maybe they get harder. Well, they certainly get bigger anyway, and be cool to find out uh, find out what that does. This dome shape, and uh, I also have a little theory as well that um, 
maybe the toxic crawlers can't uh, venture outside because any of the screenshots or gameplay, I haven't seen any um, toxic crawlers um, go outside. I've just seen them all inside the facility, so maybe um, there is certain mask for when you go inside, like a toxic gas mask, and then yeah, stick on your spacesuit, your spacesuit helmet when you go outside. So all this that be really cool and interesting to find out, and we can't wait for Resurrection Map back coming on the 23rd of August for uh, Xbox 360 and a month later for PS3. So please like, comment, and subscribe uh, for more info of Resurrection Map back. Thanks for watching.